Okay people, we're live at Phantom Cave Studios right now and we're going to have a look at for Jim Shepard Publication Day. We have the two issues in my from my collection, my secret collection. We have two of the first, well not the first, but 1000th issue number one and obviously number two. Because they made two copies of the, each one of them. Of the thousandth issue ones, and we're going to have a look at it at this very good Jim Shepard publication day. Like I told you, Jim Shepard is awesome. He did pretty good. He did a lot of good stuff for the Phantom. We ha first oh, might be yeah. I think it's the fourth page. We have a little letter. From Lee Falk. I don't usually usually like bring these sort of things out from my collection because you know they get a bit minter. So what's this first story? It's the sky band. Oh yeah. I actually found these two books, including this one up here, including that one, found them uh, at numerous collector shops. And like I said, if you catched my uh, Instagram live I just did, I there was Phantom Comics supposed to come in today, but I'll be get, I'll probably get it on Monday. I'll probably get it on Monday or any other day that I do get it on, and then I'll do it with you. So this, uh, I think it's the same story. I think it's Skyban, this one is. And then, yeah, Skyban is, um, is one of those stories... It, yeah, it starts off with... Um, Obviously, the Phantom, it starts off with the Sky Band and goes into more t context of stuff. What's this? What is this? I think this is a poster of some sort. Let me have a look. Look at this! Holy... Oh, adjust this first. Holy crap. Look at this. Look at that. That's mint. That's mint. That hasn't been touched for a while. <laughs> that just brings back pretty good memories. I might just be a newbie in this phantom stuff, but that is absolute awesome. Yeah. It's absolute awesomeness. I think there's another story coming up here somewhere. Eternative Worlds. Mandrake Magician. Yeah, you're right. Phantom's Treasure. Which is an also a big-ish story back in the day. Back in the day. Back in the day of 1969. <laughs> That's just a little joke. Little joke. Doesn't hurt no one. Now, the art, it's done by my... I think the art for these two books, they're done mostly probably of Wilson, probably a bit of Ray Moore, and probably a bit of Sly Barry. A bit of Sly Barry. Which is pretty good. You always want to have a bit of Sly Barry in the mix of things. Don't you? Phantom Chronicles. These ads, they're a bit old. They're from the 1990s and things were pretty good. Now, I wouldn't know what the 1990s was about because I wasn't even... Was not even born. I'm a ooh, I'm a two thousand. I mean the ooze kid, ooze. 
Bella, 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 Bella. This one feels a bit modern. Feels a bit modern, doesn't it? Yeah, look. Ooh, what's that? Oh, is that what I think it is? Oh, must oh, big mechanical crocodile. Yes, yes, I know what you're trying to think. I am Australian. Crocodiles do exist. Why? Why did you say that? No! No! Now, I reckon this art might be done by Sly Barry. Yeah, good old Sly Barry! Oh, what's that story? The name. The name. <gasps> Ooh. The name. If anyone wants to join me, they can. They can. Like I say in most of my videos, with these sort of books, I don't read them. I just put them in my collection. Got the introduction thing. That's the first book gun. That's the back cover of it. Second book. And also done by Jim Shepard. Damn it. Jim Shepard is pretty nice. Although I, I haven't actually met him, but I think he's pretty nice. To do all this stuff. Yeah. Yeah, right. Comic case. I wish, I wish few actually put those comic cases back out because I wasn't born then. But those things, I reckon, are pretty good. I reckon are pretty good. Oh, I know this story. I definitely know this story. Uh, yep. Um, yeah, Hoggy, Mr. Hog, I'm pretty sure. That Hog stories are pretty good. Ah, uh, Treasure of the Skull Cave, here we go, here we go. Yeah, that, I think that's the same stories in the first one. I think that same stories in the first one. I'm guessing... Or is it a different one? Anyone, any of one of you want to comment on that? They can too. I've seen that panel before. That panel right there. I've seen it. Who wouldn't have seen it? Hopefully people have, have seen it. Hopefully. Hopefully. Oh, what's this? Is this a new story? Maybe, maybe not. Let me have a look. Secret of the Bold Mountain. Dun, dun, dun! Looks like, looks modern. Looks like a 1989 story. The King's Cross Connection. This one, this story actually came, was in that 80th anniversary one. I'm pretty sure. 80th, I'm pretty sure. Because it had that same story in it and I'm pretty sure I read it but can't remember too much about it. Might need to read that again. Or I might need to put it on this channel. There we go. There's another idea for me. And use as well. Oh, there we have it. Sim Sydney Harbour Bridge. Which is pretty cool. I've lived nowhere near it. If you've watched till this um, part of the video, good, yeah, 
You're doing a good job. Anyway, if you want to subscribe down the bottom, go do that. Comment down below if you want like more live streams or something like that. Or if you want me to review the 80th anniversary edition for The Phantom. It's got some good stories in there. Um, you can like, you can share, wherever. Um, and, but most importantly, subscribe down below for more